Now this is a live look at Washington DC where Congress took action today against TikTok. The popular social media app is owned by a Chinese company with ties to China's government. The US House voted to force TikTok owners to sell the app or be banned in the United States. Fox's Rebecca Castor has more. It's one of the most widely used apps in the world, but soon TikTok could be off limits to users in the U.S. Members of Congress in the White House say it's a national security threat because of its ties to the Chinese Communist Party, and lawmakers want to force the app's Beijing-based owner ByteDance to divest. This is really uh, very much about the CCP and their ability to own uh, data and use that data. Uh, 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 nefariously against our national security interests and against our citizenry. Do we want the data from TikTok, children's data, adults' data, to be going, uh, to be staying here in America or going to China? For the most part, Republicans and Democrats seem to agree on this, with the bill easily passing through the House Wednesday morning. Our intention is for TikTok to continue to operate, but not under the control of the Chinese Communist Party. Today, we're sending a message to the CCP that we are going to deflate the 140 million spy balloons that they have installed on American phones. If ByteDance does not sell, TikTok would be banned from U.S. app stores, eliminating a platform for millions of social media influencers and business owners. Not only 5 million small businesses rely on it, but 170 million people rely on this app for more than just their livelihood. They rely on this app for their mental health. They've connected with people. Even President Biden is on TikTok, using the app to connect with Gen Z voters. But he still supports the ban. If they pass it, I'll sign it. The bill now heads to the Senate for a vote. TikTok CEO denies the Chinese government controls the app or accesses Americans' user data. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox News.